one thing that we hear all the time when we're talking about mRNA is, well, isn't this messing with our DNA? Can't this somehow alter our DNA and be harmful? And we've seen people say things like, oh, it can cause cancer and other negative outcomes. So how would you respond to that? It's an important question, of course, that RNA doesn't do those things. The only type of RNA that causes a problem is the RNA of a retrovirus that goes the other way. And HIV happens to be an example of a retrovirus that comes in as RNA and brings with it its own enzyme to turn that RNA into DNA. This does not happen except in these limited cases of retroviruses. Retroviruses are deadly, deadly viruses. And once they're in your DNA, you've got them forever. All, almost all the mm -hmm. rest of the virus families make what's called an acute infection and then they're gone. That's because they aren't messing with our DNA. RNA does not make DNA and it gets degraded pretty quickly, usually within a, a day, I would say for the most part. It, I don't know the precise numbers, but it's, it's a short-lived molecule and that's how it's designed to be. And really this makes RNA vaccines much safer, in my view, 